figuring out interesting questions in friendly or romantic conversations. How can I figure out which questions are interesting and will be pleasant for the person to whom they are addressed to answer? I am a person who has an extreme problem conveying what he wants to express. I am pedantic, repetitive, redundant, verbose, and inflexible. My thoughts simply run too fast and they overwhelm me. I have difficulty in choosing how to express myself in the words themselves. As fast as I think, I have had one too many university professors asking whether I ever get tired or whether I could stay away from so much analysis and details. I have boring interests and I tend to miss many social nuances. Trying consciously to make up for it makes me question whether or not there is a nuance when in fact there is none and useless because I can just pick up some nuance I fail to interpret it in a social context. I am otherwise excellent in picking up and interpreting nuances in an academic or purely linguistical context. My interests are broad but restricted to practical or philosophical or both. I am not interested in discussing any shows or other art, unless it is a practical matter. I am not interested in particular observations in society but only in more universal social phenomena. I enjoy culture and arts but keep it to myself or have very succinct remarks. People call me obsessed, fixated, boring, or incommodious. The complete opposite of affable. And I can only admit so. All in all it makes me believe that I should not talk or at least restrict it as much as possible. So I want to ask people questions that will please them to answer those questions and let them do the talking. I can't simply get a laundry list of interesting questions because each person has their own tastes. In my experience, it's easy to think that every question you ask someone in a conversation needs to be an amazingly clever, insightful, etc. question, which is generally not the case. Often, the questions that get people to share more, and feel like they are listened to, are simple questions that show that you're interested in what they are talking about. Questions can be as simple as affirming how they're feeling, if someone is complaining about their day, responding with, it sounds like you had a really rough day, can make them feel heard. If someone is telling a story, asking what happened next can signal that you're interested in what they have to say. You mention that you want to let the people you're talking with do the talking. Communicating that you are interested in what they have to say, whether through telling them some of what you've told us here, or asking questions that show your interest, can help with conversation. Lastly, don't write off your interests as boring. Conversations work well when both participants are interested in what the other person has to say. Sure, many people might not be interested in linguistics or academics, but some people are, and you may find you have good conversation with them.